Psycon changes completely at nighttime, make sure to grab your flashlight so we can see and hear all the different animals around us. Forget my lantern. Wish my eyes were better. That's okay, Irvy. You can use my flashlight. Oh, thanks, Sonny. Let's go on a hike. Deer are most active around dusk and dawn. Even though they may appear large in size, they are prey animals. Deer have adaptations to help them avoid predators. Some examples include their eyes on the side of their head that give them more than 310 degrees of vision, and their cup-shaped ears which help them hear sounds from all directions. Let's not disturb this group. Oh, it's so pretty up here on Les Oh, and that first star is so bright up there. Actually, Irvy, that's not a star. That's a planet. We can go and take a closer look from that telescope that's up here. Let's go. Oh. I've got it all set up. Now you can see Venus, the second planet from the sun. Whoa, what a cool planet. Oh, and all those pretty stars. Even though the stars are many light years apart, they appear closer together. Because of this, many people throughout human history have created constellations by connecting stars with imaginary lines to form pictures. In the winter over Sycon, you can see Taurus the Bull on the right and Orion the Great Hunter on the left. group of seven stars that students can see throughout the year makes up the famous constellation that most refer to as the Big Dipper. However, the Big Dipper is a part of a larger constellation known as Ursa Major, the Great Bear. Hope you enjoyed the stars. Let's go see what nocturnal animals we can find. Sycon is home to Moctixia which is the only known bioluminescent millipede. They are found mostly in moist areas and dark forest grounds. These millipedes produce a chemical reaction creating a greenish blue glow. Most times this glow warns nocturnal predators of the danger that the Moctixia bring if threatened. Using a UV light is the easiest way to find these nocturnal millipedes. However, if you allow your eyes to adjust for 15 to 30 minutes, you might be able to see their glow without one. Make sure to stay quiet so we can hear the nocturnal animals of the night. Ooh, 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 ooh